Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back to my another tutorial. Today I will show how to install WordPress on Jump in local server. So let's start it. Today we need uh, Jump server and WordPress. So let's start it to beginning. Go to Google and search jump and go to download to button and download the latest version of jump server so here is the latest version my configuration is 64 bit so i can download this 64 okay now download Wait while downloading. So after completing the file, now we will download. Now we will download WordPress. WordPress. So here you can download, download and install. Click now. Download WordPress 6.0 in the latest version. So already I have downloaded this. Now I skip this option. Okay. Now we will have to install Jump server. Okay. Let's go the download location and double click on the file. Sorry, I have some error issue uh, because of Windows 11 or lag. So please wait. Okay, click yes and wait a few time. Nami, click OK. Now you will see the interface. Click next. Now we will need PHP admin. So you can uh, add this, uh, no issue. Uh, we, we will need only Apache and MySQL. So we will skip this and click next and next. So choose your language as you like. So I have selected English and click next. Learn about Vietnami for jump. So I don't need. Okay, next. Next. And wait while unpacking file. You will have to wait some time because of unpacking. Please wait while installing. If you need any other tutorial, let me know in email or comment section to next video will be that. This will take few time for unpacking, quite while well unpacking.
We will wait more few time. If your PC configuration is faster, then you can install it very short time. So I will show next video how to install manual or any soft class software or anything else via live server. So stay with me to next update. Please wait while installing or you can skip this video while installing. If you like this video, please like on the video. So jump server is very easy to use and it's very helpful to learn any coding system or CMS system because you don't need to any internet connection or anything else while you, you are using server. Our installing will be finished within short time. Please wait while installing. The system will be notified when installing finished. So, already finished. Now they are creating installer, shortcut, and more. Already 75% installed. So, already finished. So, do you want to start the control panel now? Yes, I want. Finish. So, now you have to start Apache and MySQL. Okay, start, start. So, now we will go MySQL config.
ओके एडमिन सॉरी देयर इज एन इश्यू Okay, now we will refresh. Now fixed. Okay, now we will have a new database name. Click on new and we can use WordPress. Okay, now create. So we have created our WordPress database. Now, if you need any account. Permission so you can use our account. So we will use uh, Good permission. So we will use on this. Okay uh, So we don't need any additional user accounts. So if you need uh, uh, Unique things uh, you will need to provide uh, online server so you can you can use account So we will have to CMS WordPress and go to local dc and look at jump folder and go to stc st docs and create here a folder new folder so we will name this wordpress this is our hosting as like live server okay so open now and paste here WordPress and extract file. So we will extract here. Okay. So done. We need to move this here. So we can delete this from here. Okay, delete. Now we'll have to remember that our server is WordPress localhost slash WordPress. So we will uh, localhost slash WordPress. Sorry, WordPress. So enter. You will show the installation. Interface. Wait, the server is responding. We will have to check. Uh, okay, we can check also here. Yes, it's responded. So we got this. Select your language and click continue. I will choose English. Continue. Now let's go. Here's the database name. We used database name as WordPress. Already you know. And username. That database username. Oh, we don't create any username. So we use root. And password. We don't have any password for root. Click space. And our database host is localhost. And the table prefix. We can use WP default. Okay. Now submit. So, all right. Um, we already success installing the PHP. Now click on run the installation as normal. So here we can use uh, site title and username and password. So I will use this password by default. We don't recommend for the very weak password you have to use. So uh, this is my local server. So there is no worry. Okay. Uh, if you want to go live server, so you have to use uh, very strong password is like that. It's like that. Okay. Very strong password. So I use this and confirm weak password. 
and email we have to use email because of privacy concern if you forget your local server password you have to reset for this email now install wordpress so we are done to install the cms wordpress okay login so we have saved this password and the login so finally we have installed wordpress on the local server we can see everything is okay so done thank you so much for watching my video please if you like my video please subscribe and like and comment on my video thank you allah hafiz